Um, this is gonna be a rush video because I'm waiting for someone to pick me up. Um, carpool. Um, but I'm five months on tea. Uh, this is like my normal talking voice, but like my voice can actually go a lot deeper than that. I just wanted to share some of the updates from my last update, which was two months. I'm five months on tea, guys. My bed is a mess, excuse that. This is like Maui half shark, half demigod cosplay that I have building over here. Um, my bed is a mess, my life is a mess, my room is a mess, what's new? Um, let's talk about the changes uh, since two months and changes that I've noticed. My voice has definitely gotten a lot deeper. I will include the like pre-T to five month um, voice update. Um, I do post a lot more updates on my Instagram, um, like singing and physical appearance thing. My face is definitely angled out more, which I didn't really notice until someone pointed out to me. Someone also said that my shoulders got, um, like, broadened out, um, which I didn't really notice, and I still don't really notice. I don't really notice, like, my changes much until someone else points it out. Uh, my brows have probably gotten thicker, still have a pizza face, you know. Uh, let's see, look at those stash hairs. I mean, look at my acne too, but oh my god. Look, okay, so I have like stash hairs here and here, but like none right here in the middle. And it's like, oh my god, it's like a reverse Hitler stash, that's what my friend calls it. Um, uh, yeah, Adam's apple right here. It's kind of growing out a little more, a little more, a little more. I've also been passing a lot more, which is great. Um, I work at Starbucks, and uh, customers have been calling me like he and him and gentleman and sir um, more. Um, usually, the people that call me gentleman are like people from like the UK that like have like European accents. And like this mom came in with her kid, and her kid was like, "Mom, mom, mom, mommy, mom." And then she's like, "Excuse you, I'm talking to this young gentleman right here." And then like if people kind of like don't know my gender or like assume my gender at least they like double take and then they go uh sir or like they like hesitate and then they realize that like oh i'm a dude um okay if you're a family member or like an acquaintance that i'm not very close with you might just want to like censor out your ears for this lower growth has occurred. The three H's are definitely present. I've been told that there are three H's that come with taking testosterone. Hot, hungry, horny. But then I also kind of forget to eat sometimes, so there's that. I haven't checked my weight in a little while, but um, it was like before taking tea, it was like 92, 93. And then when I took tea, um, starting out, I was like 100, 101 pounds. Um, and then it decreased because I forgot to eat again. Like. Uh, I just had the tendency to forget to eat food. My tea dosage decreased after three months. Um, so my tea dosage, like, uh, bi-weekly was one milliliter. And then after three months, I got lab work done. And then that was 0.8 milliliters. And then they double-checked it after one month um, to check my tea levels because my tea levels were too high. And if you have too high of tea levels, then that can convert back to estrogen. After that one month, of being on a uh, tea for 0.8 milliliters. I am staying on it for another three months, so until I'm like six months on tea. Um, still do it bi-weekly. Um, I did change my needle sizes when I ran out. Um, the withdrawal needle is 18 gauge, so it's like a lot quicker to withdraw it. Um, and then the injection needle is still, like into my skin is still uh, 25 gauge. I'm just like pretty fucking scattered. Those are the only things I can think of. I feel like I had more things to say, but I can't think of them currently, but um, thanks for watching guys. This is my voice pre tea. This is my voice one month on tea. This is my voice two months on tea. This is my voice three months on tea. This is my voice four months on tea. This is my voice five months on tea.